if you guys are looking to get Microsoft Office for free, aka Microsoft 365, as it's called now, I'm going to show you how in this video, and I'm actually going to show you two different ways you can go about doing it. So let's get started. For this first method, we just go to office.com. And when you get here, you'll see the option to sign in or get Microsoft 365. If you clicked on get Microsoft 365, that's where you have to purchase it. But if you just click sign in, you can go ahead and make a Microsoft account if you don't already have one. Um, so I'm just going to sign into mine here. And um, by the way, the second option that I'm going to show you in this video is not going to require an account, but we'll get to that later. Okay, so once you do sign in, this is going to be the homepage. On the left hand side, you'll see you have tabs for Microsoft Word, Excel and PowerPoint. If you were to click on any of these, I'll click on Word. Um, I can go ahead and click new blank document here and it'll open up the appropriate homepage for whatever program you're using. So as you can see, this is Microsoft Word. I can go ahead and make my documents here and I could save them to my computer or I believe they're automatically saved to your account online. So the drawback to this method is you don't actually have these programs installed on your computer and that means you will need internet access to use them. So this next method will allow us to use it completely locally, offline, without internet. I'll show you what we got to do. All right, so I opened a new tab and I'm just going to go to openoffice.org. I'll put a link in the description if you want. Um, but if you're on the homepage, you just want to click I want to download Apache Open Office, and from here you will select the type of operating system you have. So if you have a Windows computer, select Windows. If you have Mac, you will go down to the OS X, but I have Windows, so I'm going to click that. All you have to do now is click Download Full Installation. A new tab will open, and you'll see in the bottom left it starts to download it. Okay, so once you've noticed the download is complete, you can go ahead and left click it. You'll get a pop-up. You can just click on yes. And now we're just going to close out of our browser and go through the setup process. So just click next, click on unpack. Then you can click next again. You can fill out this information if you want. Click next. Most of the time you're just going to select typical and click next. And then you can finally click install. So we're going to let this finish and then I'll show you guys what you have to do from there. All right, so once it's all done, you can select finish and as you can see i have the open office shortcut on my desktop now if you still have this folder on your desktop or in your downloads folder you can just delete it and now i'm just going to double click on open office to open it up and this is going to be what you're greeted with so as you can see you could open a text document spreadsheet or presentation and that's going to be the equivalent to microsoft word excel and powerpoint so like I said, this one is totally free and it also doesn't require an account or internet. So between the two options, the office.com and open office, you should be all set up entirely for free. So that's going to be it for this video. If you want more how-to videos like this, just subscribe to this channel and I thank you guys for watching.